what stands out to you? What do you make of your second year here in the NBA? Uh, I feel like this year was uh, sort of a step forward uh, for me. Uh, just physically, uh, mentally, uh, I feel like I was way more comfortable this year. Uh, I sort of got in the groove of things. Uh, sort of knew my role as a as on the team. Uh, I feel like I, I mean, did pretty good overall. In terms of areas where you saw some growth within yourself, what stands out? Uh, I feel like just my confidence. Uh, I feel like that uh, growing a lot this year. I mean, with confidence, you can. I feel like you can. I showed a lot of things uh, just based off just me feeling confident, uh, like my ball handling. Uh, I shot a couple mid ranges this year. Uh, shot a couple threes. Uh, I feel like confidence is something uh, I sort of gained this year, and uh, it helped me a lot. As you went through stretches where you were playing more and then at times less, what was the key for you to staying mentally in tune and being ready when your number was called? Yeah, uh, I feel like uh, just doing the just just like working out. Uh, Doing the things that uh, last year I didn't really really do, but this year I feel like it helped me a lot. Just weightlifting, uh, getting extra work. Uh, so when my time does come, uh, I'll be 100% ready. Take me through the, the first half of the year from a team perspective as you guys are exceeding expectations. So many players have talked about how close this locker room was. It yeah. had to be a thrilling ride until unfortunately Ty has the injury. Yeah, uh, I mean, in the beginning or this whole year, really, uh, I mean, we just sort of jailed together, especially this summer. I feel like that helped us a lot last uh, last summer. And they, even at the end of the season, I felt that, I feel like it helped us just come together as a team, uh, especially with being so young. I feel like just us coming together, uh, just being tight and cool with each other, I feel like it helped us a lot uh, just on the court uh, stuff. Uh, and I feel like we uh, exceeded, like you said, exceeded expectations. Uh, I feel like nobody thought that we were just going to have a season we did. Uh, this year, and I mean, we surprised a lot of people. Uh, I'm just looking forward to next season. We talked with James a little bit, and he took a lot of pride in your development and thinks a lot of you. Yeah. What does he mean to you? Uh, I mean, he's, I mean, really, like, he's like one of the, he's like a vet, like one of my vets. Uh, yeah, I mean, I say that, uh, I say it loud, because, I mean, he, I mean, just helps me, helps, helps me a lot, like, just, just on the court stuff. Uh, whenever I'm frustrated, he, he always comes to talk to me about like, all right, you need to do this or you need to do that. Uh, and just being that helping hand, like sometimes, cause it's hard for a young players. Like, you don't really know what you get into, uh, especially like on the court, there's certain techniques, uh, like just the mindset. Uh, I feel like he just helped, helped a lot with that. Just just give me like sort of back to back to the old me, just being mentally, like mentally there, uh, just performing, uh, perform, performing my best. Rick talked about one of his goals for your development is to continue uh, defensively defending without fouling. Yeah. You did improve this year, the fouls per minute were down. Do you yeah. feel like that's still a work in progress for you? Yeah, of course. Uh, I feel like I still have a lot to learn, uh, learn uh, just on the defensive end. Uh, taking more pride in defense. I feel like that's like just been our emphasis uh, coming into this, uh, this off season. Uh, even the last couple of games, we've just been emphasizing just taking pride in defense. Uh, I feel like this is a, a, a huge step and my development this summer, uh, just getting better, uh, getting better at those things on defense. So I'm not in foul trouble because, I mean, once I get in foul, I'll just take myself out the game. And uh, it's like me on the court, uh, it's better than me sitting on the bench, so. <laughs> take me back to Detroit. You get the opportunity to start You're back in your hometown. Yeah. You have a big game. Mm -hmm. uh, had to be maybe the highlight of your season. Yeah, of course. Uh, I mean, it was amazing. Uh, I still remember that night vividly. Uh, I had similar night. Uh, my rookie year uh, where all my family came and stuff. But this year, uh, it was just, I mean, it was amazing. Uh, I mean, I love my family a lot. Uh, they mean everything to me. So just seeing them there supporting me uh, and just me, me being able to start, uh, have a, a good couple of games. Uh, I mean, that just meant a lot uh, for me. Uh, nah, I mean, every time uh, I'm there, uh, I show up, so. You talked a little bit already about your goals uh, in the future. As yeah. you hit the off season here, what needs to happen for you to be in a spot as you enter year three to start to achieve something? Uh, I mean, I feel like just taking another step forward. Uh, I mean, my body, body wise, I need to uh, put on a couple pounds and maintain, learn how to maintain my weight. Uh, then my jump shot, ball handling uh, two, are two things that I'm really looking forward to, to working on this season. Uh, because with those, I feel like, uh, I mean, my game completely changed, uh, and changed for the better. I mean, because I'll be able to do everything, like catch live, shoot the ball, 
uh, dribble the ball, not just be a uh, just an offensive threat. Uh, and with the getting bigger and stuff and getting stronger, I feel like that just helped me on defense. Uh, learning how to like guard the perimeter because I, I feel like I am a, a a good perimeter defender, but I, I want to be a great perimeter defender and just a. Uh, like those goals that I said, of just being the defensive player, player of the year. Uh, I feel like this summer is like one of those step step towards that. Uh, so I'm just something to be working on, just learning how to stay down, guard the ball, and just taking pride in uh, defense. Year two in the books. Congratulations. Appreciate and you. Best wishes here in the offseason. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.